So it's been a while since I've posted anything on Best Views From Above, um, but we'll talk about that in another video. Uh, but today I bring to you the DJI FPV Combo, which has only been out for around two weeks. Um, this is DJI's attempt to um, get into the racing drone scene and faster flying. Obviously all their other, other drones is more for video, uh, photography and that sort of thing. So um, obviously the next thing that they would need to get into is some racing drones. They do have some other kits um, that you can put into racing drones, but this is the complete package. Um, for the people that are not hands-on, don't want to solder, I just want to buy something that is, you know, ready to go out of the box. So, we'll just open this up just now. So, inside, you've got the drone itself, which is relatively small. It is a, quite a heavy beast, to be honest. Um, it's got the battery, which is on the back. It's got the sensors on the bottom, it's also got a down light um, as well. Then you've got the gimbal, this cover does come off if you wanted to. And then it's also got the standard avoidance cameras on the front. Um, it's a, four, a quad copter uh, with the four blades. I'll put that to one side just now. Next, you've got the version 2 uh, FPV goggles, uh, which I've never used. Any of the DJI uh, goggles, I've always been a fat shark guy at 5.8 gigahertz. Um, so this will be a total new experience for me. Um, so it's got the micro card, the USB-C for providing power. It's also like got, you can adjust these for people um, with wider and narrower faces. And I believe you can also get the standard um, lenses that can go in there to help people with glasses. Um, four aerials. And uh, we'll talk about that later. Then, in here, you've got the remote. So the aerial, you've got the shoot, the start-stop button for getting the blades, return to home, the modes, gimbal up and down, and then you've got this channel, this uh, button which can be programmed, and then obviously your actual gimbals itself. Um, Obviously they don't have the, the thumbs in just now. Some people fly thumbs, I fly fingers just for better control. Then in here we've got four blades. These are the red tipped, so these will go on to the ones with the A. And so you have standard direction props and then you have counter directional props. And basically the speed of those working in the opposite direction of the other um, allows you to turn and uh, also the speed up and down to allow you to pitch and roll and things. Um, in here appears to be the power adapter. So that is actually the battery for the gimbal, uh, for the headset. So cable into the goggles. Then you've also got the charger for the drone itself. Next in the box, you've then got the other set of props, which don't have the red marks on them. So this is for the B side. So obviously, there's eight blades there, but you only need four, so you've got a complete set um, in case you do break them, which more likely people will. Next in the box, don't actually know what this is. Oh, so this is the antennas, or aerials, which we then obviously screw into the, the headset. And as mentioned before, there's four of these. Then we've got a high visibility cover and to make it stand out in the sky. Cable for the charger, USB C to USB standard adapter, gimbal, thumb or finger holders 
Allen key or wrench. And then I guess this is the, the back of the headset. Also some additional cables as well for charging and also for powering the gimbal. Quick start guide and then the typical uh, disclaimer. So that is everything that's inside the box. So what I'll do is we'll uh, run through putting everything together and uh, do the first flight. Thanks.